been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating. Hey guys, welcome back to Palette Therapy. My name is Keela. If this is your first time stopping by, hey. If not, thank you for the support. Um, in today's video, I decided to just come in and talk to you guys about the new year, what my goals are, um, things that I plan on trying to accomplish, and to kind of get a feel or idea of things that you guys might be trying to do. So if you are interested, um, continue to watch this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, so um, one of my goals going into the new year is, you know, um, always, or one of my goals always is to work on my relationship with God. Um, if you don't know, or you hadn't watched any of my videos, um, I am a believer. I believe in God. I'm a Christian. Um, if you read my description box, it always start with a scripture because I always want God to be connected to anything that I do. So um, one of my goals in life period, but every year is to work on my relationship with God because I feel like um, none of us have arrived, myself included, and, and nobody's perfect. And so there's always room to improve. And if I want to get better and do better in life, then um, I have to lean on God for that. So um, that's one of my goals, which brings me to my second goal. My second goal is um, to start this Christian company that my husband and I are working on. We are working on um, branding a Christian apparel company. Hopefully sometime soon I'll be able to get you guys um, pictures and videos of it, you know, just previews and sneaks. But that is um, one of our goals together is to start a Christian apparel company. Um, and with this company, uh, we plan on, like I said, selling Christian apparel. And it's not um, race based or anything like that. It's not particularly for um, Caucasian people, African American, you know, it doesn't single out anybody. It's for everybody. It's faith based. And so um, I wanted a brand that reached out to everybody, not just a certain skin color or a certain race or nationality. Because um, in God's eyes, He doesn't see color. You know, He only sees our soul. And so that's how we should actually look at each other. And so I wanted a company that. Um, did that that projected that image uh, because in the Bible it says love covers a multitude of faults so um, instead of spreading hate and you know um, stereotypes and things like that I just want to spread love and I just want people to know that hey we love you no matter what you know God loves you no matter what and so that was one of the biggest things that um, I wanted to work on as far as our company goes. So we plan on launching um, our t-shirt business, which hopefully furthers into, you know, other apparel in January. So I'm excited about that. Um, also, currently I work um, two jobs. Um, so I plan on leaving one and focusing mainly on um, my business. Um, I feel like one thing that we mess up on, excuse me if my eyes keep looking off, um, but one thing that we mess up on is we pour too much energy into other people's dreams and not enough energy into our dreams. And so I feel like in 2021, I want to go after my goals, my dreams. I want to put as much energy into what I want and what I believe um, than just... Um, you know, support other people. It's good to support other people. That is, you know, the Christian thing to do. But, you know, why be miserable trying to help everybody else? That's not the life God called for us to live. And so I can't pour into other people's dreams and not be able to pour into my own or not be able to invest into my own. So I plan on investing a lot into myself and into this second company that my husband and I um, are about to start. Which brings me to my um, next goal. Uh, one of my next goals is to get my health together. Um, I feel like that's a goal every year. But solely every year I do 
change things. <laughs> But um, yeah, my next goal is to get my health under control. I am currently a type two um, diabetic. I take insulin, so um, I'm working to try to get off some of this medicine. That's my main goal, to lose some weight and get off some of these meds. And my husband and I, um, we don't have kids yet, but we wanna have kids, so um that's going to require me to get my health under control. My doctor already said that. But um, so, yeah, I'm going to be starting a fitness journey here soon. I plan on vlogging and documenting it so you guys can keep up with me as well. Um, right now, my goal is to lose 20 pounds. So um, I'm starting on that. I'm um, we'll try to do shakes and smoothies and you know um switch to the healthy foods but still have a balanced diet you know still eat occasional cupcake if i want one you know things like that um but yeah so my last goal is definitely to get my health under control because i've been a diabetic since before my 21st birthday so almost or oh, right at eight years and that's a long time to you know be dealing with this which i know some people have dealt with it longer you know some people are type one some people you know have different things but this is something that's kind of in my power that i can control that i can work on so um you know even if it's just getting off one med hey that's a big step that's a big goal so that's a big accomplishment so that's definitely something um i want to work on and Lastly, um, another one of my goals is kind of almost always one of my goals, but 2020 messed it up for me, um, is to just get closer with my friends and family, like spend more time with them. Life is, you know, short. People are leaving every day and I don't want to be one of those people to leave this world or my friends or family leave this world and they not know how I feel about them. So one of my goals is, you know, to get out there, make memories, um, spend time with them, you know, check in more. A lot of times we get so caught up with other things. We don't text. We don't we don't give phone calls. You know, we don't video chat and technology makes things so easy now where you don't have to pop up at somebody's house. So um, that's definitely something that I plan on working on. Um, that was one of my goals for 2020, but with the pandemic, of course, we couldn't travel, we couldn't do things. Um, I do have, or I do, I do, however, talk to my friends a lot more. I talk to them probably once a week, once every two weeks, uh, way more than I did previously. But we didn't get to spend a lot of time together. Um, I did get to go on a girls trip with two of my friends. Um, if you haven't seen that, I do have a video out, a vlog. We went to New Orleans, so go check that out. But so, yeah, um, that's definitely my last goal um, is to, you know, spend some time with my family and friends. So, yeah, that is about it. That wraps up my goals for 2021. I am excited about the year. I know a lot of people um, look down on 2020 and the pandemic and COVID-19 and all those things but I feel like this was just um this just gives us gave us a chance to self-reflect and work on the real issues and not be able to make excuses like we've been doing because that was one of my things um I always well I work too I work all the time so I can't do this so I can't do that and uh COVID-19 just kind of shut that down the pandemic shut that down so um it definitely let me work on myself and work on my issues and you know brought to light things that i feel like are important or you know it definitely opened up the entrepreneur in me and made me want to go out and you know work for myself and not have my life or my family life dependent on somebody else and how their business is doing so um 2020 was just an eye-opening year, and I feel like 2021, you know, you apply what you learned in 2020 to 2021, and you know, this is the year we're going to excel. So, I pray that you guys have a good 2021 as well, you know. Um, but, that's the end of this video. Um, if you're interested in this makeup look, let me know. I will create a video for it. 
I actually tried to make a video for it, but my camera wasn't recording, so. But it's a simple look. It's not as hard as it looks. So if you guys are interested, um, let me know. I can recreate it. Um, I may just do it again anyways because it turned out so pretty. But yeah, let me know if you guys are interested in this look. So thank you for watching this video. As always, thank you for the support. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with your BFF, and I will catch you in my next one. Somebody told me I should hit